As a CISO, you're responsible for building the security strategy, managing budgets, and reporting on the security posture of the enterprise. But do you have the data and visibility into the performance of all your controls to report in a meaningful way to your executives? SafeBreach enables teams to test out the efficacy of their security controls and gain insights into their security posture to help drive down cyber risk. The SafeBreach platform provides several predefined dashboards that bring visibility into the effectiveness of your controls and the organization's security posture against specific threats. In this video, we review the security posture dashboard that lets you easily understand your posture by business units, security controls, and threat groups. The overall status breakdown supplies a bird's eye view of how many attacks were prevented, detected, or completely missed. The status breakdown over time is a trend to map the improvements to control performance and uncover when a configuration change has opened a security gap in your stack. In any of the predefined outputs, you can edit the widgets to enhance your view. For example, you can update the status and include tracking over time to include detected attacks. A widget for the breakdown of attack phases. On any graph, you can quickly drill in and determine which attacks were prevented and which controls blocked them. For example, by selecting the host level graph, the full list of all prevented attacks is displayed. Select a specific attack result such as extract security package using PowerShell and you're presented with details of the attack, the parameters used, the MITRE attack classifications, all the simulation steps, and which of the controls prevented the attack. The next set of charts is the breakdown of controls by category with a clear display of which controls create the biggest exposure for the organization. By selecting the missed section on any graph, you can get a detailed view of all the attacks that an endpoint solution should have prevented or detected. Business units have different requirements and it's imperative to monitor the security posture of each unit. With a shift to at-home employees, it's critical to ensure that your remote workforce does not expose your business to additional threats. You can have all the widgets on the dashboard updated with a single click by selecting the axis of any graph, in this case, the VPN BU. As you can see, all the widgets have been updated to reflect only the status for the BU of VPN environment across the full dashboard. Selecting back returns to the original dashboard. Controls by BU highlights which controls are being used in each unit. The latest threats are headline news, and you need to quickly know your posture against those threats. The top threat groups sheds light on which groups pose the most concern to your organization. Crown Jewel's risk reporting is to help gauge the potential exposure of critical assets being exfiltrated or held hostage, and the MITRE tactic view of all attacks that were prevented, detected, or missed, along with the flexibility to drill into the efficacy output of all your security controls, you can easily customize any of the graphs or even remove and add new widgets. Select Add a Widget to get a library of predefined widgets grouped by MITRE Attack, Threat Assessment, Security Controls, Results Summary, Operational, and Risk. Now you can communicate with accurate and current data to stakeholders as these powerful dashboards are exportable and can be shared on a regular basis across the organization. With SafeBreach flexible dashboards, you can quickly and effectively highlight the alignment of security investments to business goals for the right business units. It's another way that SafeBreach enables you to manage security spend effectively and efficiently with outcome-driven metrics. To learn more, visit us at safebreach.com.